practices now have the ability to add multiple quote templates and customize the estimate of cost to change how the fee and rebate are displayed for a quote. To add a new quote template, sites can navigate to settings and then quote templates. Within here, all sites should have at least one default template, which should reflect the quote template from prior to this update. To add a new template, select the Add button. At the top of the Edit Quote Template window, sites must enter a name for the quote. You can then select the estimate of cost format you wish to use. This can now be set from three different options. Fee, rebate and gap with the gap bolded. Fee, rebate and gap with the total bolded. And fee only with the total bolded. Once the estimate of cost format has been selected, practices will also have the option to select the appropriate letterhead to be used on the quote template. This can be selected in the same way that they would do in standard letter templates by clicking on the letterhead area and selecting a letterhead from their list of letterheads. And finally, we can also edit the free text that is available to be edited under the estimate of cost, which is the same functionality that would have existed in the standard edit quote template window from before this update. Once we're happy with the changes we've made to our quote template, we can select the save button to save that template. When adding a quote for a patient, users will now have the option to select the template they wish to use. If they only have the one default template, which will be the standard setting for practices after this update before they've created a new template, this will be chosen by default. If they have multiple templates, the user will need to select the appropriate template at the time of creating the quote. Once we've selected our template, we can then print, save or email this and the quote information should then appear on our newly created quote template format.